sometimes you wake up in the morning to a dead horse right outside your house, outside your office. Walk to my office like this, and it's a boy. There's your boy right there, knocked. KO'd. Alright, so what the deal is with that is um, one of my neighbors is a horse trainer. He teaches, um, he like, trains horses how to pull carts and stuff in 2020. But anyways, um, so he, yeah, he does, and he also, I'm just kidding, he also, um, like, he, you know, uh, breaks horses and stuff like that. Um, but he does teach them how to pull a cart. The next door won't open. For usual. Anyways, so, uh, from time to time, and by time to time I mean all the time, he'll bring the horses over and, like, tie them up. And, um, like, you know, let them kind of graze over in the yard of the fundacion and stuff and sometimes by the houses which is not preferable but anyways so last night i saw him out there and uh i just you know saw it laying down i thought i thought he was tired i was right but not in the right way and so i came out this morning and he's obviously bloated or she he told me is obviously bloated a little bit and stuff and so i don't know how they're gonna get that out of there but or how we're gonna get that out of there because i'm sure I'll probably play a part in that. So, anyways, get back to today's video. Or get to today's video. Get started. Alright, so this morning's goal is to um, sand all that down. And get it, get the wall sanded down, all the imperfections out. Um, yeah, and then after that, we'll dust it off. And then kind of um, the leftover dust, we'll clean it off with like a damp rag. And um, then we'll obviously let it dry. And then it'll be ready for varnish. And then sand again and varnish again, blah, blah, blah. Um, so yeah, let's get started. Y'all don't make fun of my baggy joggers. These are my work pants, all right? wiping down um, the wall after sanding it and uh, what did I do? You saw it. Uh, yeah, uh, we sanded down the hard so there's some really rough spots. Um, though, I mean, the wood is cheap wood. It's not the best wood ever, so it's not gonna be silky smooth, you know, or whatever, but um, just trying to sand out as much rough spots as we can with the orbital sander, even though you're not supposed to sand those directions on, you're supposed to sand with the direction of the wood, but. Had to get rid of those tough spots and then um we just hand sanded it down some some of the like medium and, and lighter spots where there's some imperfections and then uh clean the dust off and so clean the dust off uh brushed it off and then i just wiped it all down with the wet rag and so we'll let it like you know dry it's not super wet it's just outside but we'll let it dry and then um we'll varnish it i was going to put the varnish uh it part in this video but i think I think I'm gonna wait and do it in another video because I think on the top part, I, well I know, we're gonna paint it black up there. And so I think I wanna, I think we need to paint it black. We need to paint up above first, just in case it gets down. I got stuff all in my face, it's dust and dirt. Anyways, it's like every single video I got stuff in my face. 
Uh, but anyways, I think we're gonna paint first and then um, so that if paint drips on there, we can kind of wipe it off and then come back and do the varnish or I don't know, we'll see. But I'm gonna end this video here, uh, keep it short for the day and we'll see you next time. Hopefully we'll have a finished product. You'll kind of be able to see how does the varnish and stuff like that. Thanks for watching all these videos. Uh, yeah, I appreciate it. I really do appreciate the support and the love and just watching it. It takes work to do these videos even though it's not a lot of work. It's not like they're the best ever. But in the middle of doing everything else that we're doing, it's work to me. So thank you. We'll see you next time.